How's it going guys, Mr. Game of Famer, and today we have the first episode of the AFC Bournemouth career mode here in FIFA 17. Very excited to uh, start this series, and the reason why I chose Bournemouth is because they are the smallest team in the Premier League. Also, I wanted to use the Premier League because it, you know, definitely the most exciting league in the world. And also has the licensed stadiums, and I'm just excited to start off uh, FIFA 17 with the with AFC Bournemouth. A very small club, only has a right well, like 10, 11,000 seat stadium. So I'm very excited to start start this series. And here, a quick thing you saw right there was that I disabled the summer window. And the reason because I just wanted to try out some of these players that they had. I didn't want to spend all the money. Are you bringing good players? I want to see what players I actually like from the starting squad that I was given already. And then in January, I'd be like, okay, so what players I can sell, what players I can keep. So that was a big reason as to why. And I'm doing, I guess uh, you saw right there, uh, preseason tournaments. You see, here's the objectives. I should talk about the uh, preseason tournaments later. Um, objectives. Uh, for youth development, it's very low, but it told us to. Well, I, I was it's kind of quick. So, rank exposure is low, content success is low because we're not in the content of success. I'm not in the content of competition. Domestic success is low, and medium was. Uh, I totally forgot. Uh, I was too busy talking about stupid preseason tournaments, and I'm gonna talk about it right now because I'm not. I'm just gonna sim them. Who cares? And here's our transfer budget, 47 million. It's not terrible, to be honest. And here's the formation. We're doing a 4-2-3-1. Uh, I think that'll be helpful, especially with the team we were given. So we have Wilson, Wilshire, Jordan Ibe, Gradle, um, Archer. I have Lewis Cook in the starting lineup as well. Uh, Nathaniel Ake, Mark Wilson, uh, Steve Francis, Andy Smith. I want to say that's the the uh, left, the right back. And uh, Borch in gold. And we're also playing counter attacking football. So... Um, yeah, I'm, uh, I'm very excited, and here's a, just a squad report, you can see some of the players that are also loaned out, some players that did not make the starting lineup, and yeah, very excited, um, I've played some games on, in this, uh, FIFA 17, and it's a lot of fun, I played the demo, which is a lot of fun, as well, this is a good step in the right direction, hopefully next year, or just over this year, they can improve, um, manager mode, because it's still kind of, eh, but I really want, I still, it still didn't deny me to play this game. So it still didn't decide me to make a manager crew mode because I, I just, I still play manager crew mode a lot. So over here, we're just going to sell some players. We put up Grabin, uh, Mark Pugh, and uh, for, uh, our back, Daniels, our, our backup left back. Our 72 of our left back. Um, actually, will be my third start, like our third string, you see to say, because... I would rather use uh, Ake and Tyrone Mings over um, uh, Daniel. So here's a short list I compiled. It, it was kind of a quick one, I, to be honest. So I put some players in that were, I didn't look up anything. I didn't use some of the, the scouting reports, uh, the scouts that we were given. Um, I didn't look at their reports. I was just, I was just thinking of players on the top of my head. And I was like, oh, okay, so I can look up this player, look up this player in this league. It was, it was kind of quick. And over time, I will obviously get rid of some players I don't want in the short list. And obviously, I'm not going to sign all of them. Duh. Um, yeah, some players that I don't want. And I'll be adding players over time as well. So here in the catalog, um, I did a scout, a scout feature star last year for my Paris FC career mode. And this one, I will also be doing a scout feature, um, a scout feature star. And also, you see there, the 80 up top is... That's our manager um, rating, so that's going to change over time as well and see how long we'll be the manager for Bournemouth. So here's the International Cup, Friendly Cup against Hoffenheim. That was our first game. We drew 1-1, one one, Wilshire with the goal. I was doing some more training and all that. Um, I don't know what else to say. I'm just so excited to see what we can do with this team. And uh, here's a, another game against Newcastle. Re recently relegated Newcastle. We lost 2-1. And Bournemouth against Gwingamp, the French team, we lost one to nothing. So we did not make it out of our group. We only got $1.4 million. And they weren't 
all that like they were happy but they didn't give a crap probably they didn't give a crap because obviously it's a friendly so but my rating did go down to a 79 so it's it's obviously early days and also so and actually there is a 78 so but big deal uh no big deal but anyway here's our scout future star and i was disappointed because a it was a left mid second his potential wasn't the greatest it was only like up to an 82 so it wasn't that great 56 will be okay whatever but who knows could we have a potential ronaldo or could we have like a quaresma nani situation that doesn't really live up to their expectations who knows no offense to those players i, I like those players in the ultimate team um but yeah i already got those uh, those ratings for the, the shortlisted players so yeah and he actually did offer him offer him a uh, contract and you can see his stats and let's say yeah they're terrible low low uh work rates and four star weak foot but two star skill moves for a winger that is terrible either way i'm still going to develop him because let's why not why not um scout um you know develop him because who knows what he can do so actually our predicted finish has to be 11th which is actually quite high to be honest and i will take a mid table position um i definitely think we could definitely compete mid table and stay we're definitely gonna stay up i think in my opinion it's gonna be tough for, to get into european competition the first year but don't worry when you have enter cool name here as manager who knows what could happen so stay tuned next episode will be the start of the premier league season and yes yeah, stay tuned for that so thank you guys for watching comment rate and subscribe more content on this channel and i'll see you guys next time